on your table, people. So I just finished a workout. I'm tired and I'm sweaty, but I just want to go over some things because I've been noticing them on social media. Back to the labels and the misinformation. Your diet and your health is all about balance. So after my workout, I like to get a little carbs and I like to get some protein. So yeah, I'm going to have a protein shake. And to put in it, to sweeten it a little bit, I'm going to use some almond milk. But when I make my coffee tonight, I'm going to use regular cow's dairy milk. And for supper, we are going to smoke some ribs and pork chops for some other added protein um, on the smoker. So I'm going to get protein, dairy, um, carbs, all the different nutrients that my body needs in many different forms. And just because something is healthy and wholesome, that doesn't mean it's organic or it's GMO free or non-conventional. So just remember that when you're making your meal. You want a diet that's well-rounded. You want some good leafy greens, you want some good vegetables, some fruits, all those different things. They all help your body function, they help your memory and your brain development, and just like you feed your body, it's the same for the rest of your family. So it doesn't matter how you get those nutrients, just try to get them all in. It doesn't matter how or where you're buying that product, you just want to make sure that it's grown and made here in the U.S. by U.S. farmers and ranchers who are providing the best quality, safest, and nutritional products, no matter how they are grown. If you are eating something that is fresh, it is healthy. So remember that when you are eating your vegetables and eating your meat.